We're going to go over the torque equation. Torque is the cross product of displacement and force. The cross product is a vector operation which outputs another vector. Now a common way this equation is written, just the magnitude of displacement times the magnitude of force multiplied by the sine of the angle between the displacement and force vectors. Now I want to give you an example of using this equation. Let's say you're looking at a lever, where the lever is attached to a knob, which is the axis of rotation. Now let's say that you force the lever, and notice how the force is perpendicular to the displacement from the lever arm. The sine of 90 degrees is 1, so whenever the force and displacement are perpendicular, all you need to do is multiply the two magnitudes. But now let's say instead of applying a perpendicular force, you apply an anti-parallel force. The sine of 180 is equal to zero, meaning whenever the force is parallel or anti-parallel to the displacement, the entire torque is going to be equal to zero. And I think this actually makes logical sense. Imagine you walked up to a door in your house. If you pushed the side of your door, you would push the door against its hinges. You might break your door, but you wouldn't cause the door to rotate one way or the other. So hopefully this gives you a better understanding on the concept of torque.